Hello, hey guys. So this video is totally different than anything that I've ever done before. I feel a little silly because my husband Mark is actually videoing me for the first time ever. Everything that I've done up until this point, I've done by myself. So I'm trying not to laugh and, and it's kind of funny. I'm also trying to be kind of quiet because my boys are asleep in bed right now. So I'm sitting here at the dining room table and I'm really excited. I got a package delivered today from the Little Prince of Oregon Nursery. Um, they reached out to me earlier this week and asked if I would uh, like to do an unboxing video. I've been following them on social media for a while now and I just love their products. What happened was I saw their one of their uh, chick charms and I just thought it was so beautiful and I ordered one and, um, and they reached out to me and contacted me about this. So, I will get right in here and I haven't opened anything yet. And we'll take a look inside here and see what we got. Some cute little stickers. The boys will love those. How cute are they? And welcome happy planners. Your air plans have arrived. Uh oh, let's see what we've got in here. And some other little information. So I'm just gonna show you guys what everything looks like right here. Okay, you can see everything looks so nice. Look how they have it all individually wrapped like that. Looks awesome. I don't see anything messed up or knocking around. So I'm just gonna dig right in and show you these one by one. I went and I grabbed this one first because I can already recognize what plant this is and I love this plant so much. Let's see. So let's unwrap this here. Look at this beautiful plant. Oh my gosh, it is so pretty. So this is a maiden hair fern. It is so beautiful. Let me get the tag here to show you guys. Himalayan maiden hair, here we go. I have had multiple maiden hair ferns and I'm not even gonna lie, I've killed a couple of maiden hair ferns. One back here where this pottery is on the bench there. And they are fragile plants. They're so beautiful and delicate. I'm gonna try my best not to kill this one, you guys. They don't like a lot of like heat from your heater that comes in. They don't like a lot of cold. They like uh, moisture um, from a mister, or you can put them on a pebble tray and have the heat radiate up from the pebble tray, but they're delicate. So you have to treat these gingerly and not a lot of harsh light. Okay, so let's see. Next plant here, fit for a king, coral bells. Look at this, guys. How beautiful is this? Check that out. Super gorgeous. Love it. Love the texture, love the color. It's beautiful, beautiful plant. This one is a fern also, I can see. This is beautiful. And you can just see how nice everything is contained and nicely kept together. And I'm gonna do this. There we go. That way I can keep the mess on the cardboard. But again, we've got a fern here and this one is a, a soft shield fern. I love any kind of fern. I'm a sucker for a fern. Look how delicate and beautiful these leaves are. I just wanna to touch it, it's so pretty. Mark, do you wanna to touch it? I just started getting into succulents about a year ago and oh my gosh this is so beautiful look at this this is the gold nugget how beautiful is that and look at all the babies oh my gosh it's so pretty <laughs> I love it and you can pop all these little baby ones off and plant them individually. It's just so cute. I can't wait to work with that one. Absolutely gorgeous. Okay. All right. Mangave, is that how you pronounce that? I'm assuming so. Uh, M-A-N-G-A-V-E. How else are you gonna say that? Here, let me take off some of this wrap to show you guys the full plant. So beautiful. Look at this. 
I want to give a shout out to a great house plant, um, a great house plant page I follow, the Thrifted Planner. She's amazing, and I know she's gonna love all these. So check her out because her page is awesome and her channel is awesome. Okay, I'm gonna stick these back in here so I can remember which is which. That would help. Okay, this is so much fun. These are all plants that. I get to like experience for the first time. Okay, so this is Made in the Shade. Um, this is a heart's tongue fern, but I am a fern fan for sure. I love that they put this protective wrap on there. Okay, so let's get on all that. Heart's tongue fern, so pretty, like really thick leaves, very, very sturdy. <laughs> Would you call it sturdy? I guess so. Here we go. Okay. I, I may have tipped off that I liked ferns. <laughs> so thank you for sending ferns because I like ferns. Oh, this one is so pretty. Okay. <clears throat> I see people butcher, butcher names and now here I go. Okay. Polystichum, Senefernum, Congestum, right? Here we go. That's what it says. And I think I may have said it right. Either way, I'm loving it. Look at this plant. It's beautiful. Look, it's got like these little little tendrils coming up here. I love that. I love that ferns do that. I really, really like this one a lot. This might be a new favorite in competition with the maiden hair. I really like the texture on this one. Very pretty. Looks like we've got one more. Oh, I think this is an air plant. And guess what? I have no air plants. And now I have an air plant. I'm so excited. <laughs> How cool is that? Okay. This is a Talansia, Talansia, Ionantha, Talansia, Ionantha. I'm going to show you guys this tag. Okay, and let's read a little bit about this one. Okay, so maintaining your air plant requires little care. That's good. Uh, you want to thoroughly wet it once or twice a week allow for good air circulation. They prefer a bright filtered light. Optimum, te optimum temperature between 50 to 90 degrees Fahrenheit. I think I can do that. <laughs> I wanna really thank Little Prince of Oregon for sending me these awesome plants. Go check them out. The folks over at Little Prince of Oregon gave me a coupon code to give to you guys for 20% off your order, which is fantastic. It's H-I-G. 20. I'm going to go ahead and drop a link to their website below so you can check them out. And just for your reference, you can follow them at Little Prince of Oregon on Facebook and on Instagram at Little Prince to Go. So HIG20 guys, check them out. You can see this beautiful display of plants that I have. I don't want to knock any over here, but I'm already like plotting and planning what I'm gonna do with all these gorgeous plants and where I'm gonna put them. I'm so excited and I'm excited to share that coupon code for, with you guys. So thank you once again to Little Prince of Oregon for reaching out and sending me these gorgeous plants and I just look forward to working with you guys again in the future. Thank you so much guys, thank you for watching. Mm -hmm.